Hello my classy people, how y'all doing? Wayne Bolden from the Speed King channel. As always, if you're watching the video, turn on your closed captures. That way you can see the narrative going across your screen. And of course, if you need to get a hold of us for our tip sheet or t-shirts or any other thing, please email us at speedking24 at yahoo.com. Speedking24 at yahoo.com. Well, New York, New York. Big city dreams, you make it there, that's right, you can make it anywhere. We're heading to Aqueduct on Saturday, it's the 8th race. It is the correction stakes for 4 year olds and up fillies and mares going 6 furlongs for 100,000 on the dirt. Small field of 6, we're going to dive right in, this shouldn't take very long. The number one horse, easy to bless. Well, it's easy to like this here filly. She's four year old, the number one horse. She's won seven of 16 starts. That's very, very hard to knock. She's ran, uh, ran four, uh, four times. So 11 starts, first to second out of 16. Um, you just cannot knock that under any circumstance. Very, very nice horse, easy to bless. Farrow is our trainer of record. Davis is in the yards. And the fact of the matter is she's been beaten up on allowance horses and this is the time to step into a unlisted overnight stake race. Now, her speed figure out of her last race on the 24th of February isn't that great. However, she's a filly. I like to bet fillies on off races. But two back, she has a number back there that puts her in contention here. So, I don't think she can win this race, but I would be more than happy to use the number one, easy to bless, underneath. I mean, this filly really do like to win. She's won seven of 16, and it's very, very hard to be negative on her. The number two horse, well, here's the horse I, do, I like. Don't let sweet fool you. Don't let the sweetness fool you. Don't let sweet fool you is the keys to the engine. Here's your speed, folks, at 5 to 1. 15 starts, 6 wins, 1 second, and 2 thirds. You can't shake a stick at that. Uh, I mean, this horse is by State, uh, State Thirsty. Vargas Jr. is in the arms. This horse last race was horrible over at Turfway on the synthetic. And uh, open up a big lead to the half mile pole. Very, very fast numbers going front, but end up finishing 10th by 22. I disregard that race altogether and throw it out. To me, the number two horse is the clear speed in here, and they're going to have to come and get this horse. This horse should open up a clear, clear lead against these, according to the numbers and the pace numbers and my speed analysts that I see here. The number two horse, uh, don't let sweet fool you. Don't let this horse fool you. This horse can flat out motor. And there are some ones that's in here that's going to come and try to get her. That's no doubt about that. But I'm going to try to take the engine here. As always, speed is what? King. The number two will surely be my top pick. Because I'm always trying to go gate the wire. For sure. And five to one, I love the value. The number three horse, club card. Well, here's the horse they have to beat. Okay, club card, a number three, has 23 starts, five wins, nine seconds. No, you didn't. Sounds like a bridesmaid to me. This six-year-old likes to run second a whole bunch. Nice trainer, Mr. Callbrook. Uh, Mr. Davis, Dylan Davis is in the arms. This horse is coming off of a 119-day uh, freshening. Now, is the six-year-old better days behind her? I don't know. But she is 6 to 5 in the morning line, and I'm not willing to find out. Now, I would use her, of course, because she's just too good not to. But this horse surely likes to run second. She has 9 seconds and 5 wins. And she's 6 years old, making her 6-year-old debut off of a 3-and-a-half-month layoff. So, I mean, she may not be what she used to be. And at 6 to 5, I'm not willing to push my money in there on her. Not me. The number four horse, well, this here, Prodigy Doll. Very nice horse, three wins from 14 starts. You can't shake a stick at that. And here's the other horse that I like in the race at a cool six to one. Prodigy Doll, to me, comes out of a, a grade three stake race at Laurel 
which was the Barbara Finch Stakes, uh, seven furlongs for two hundred thousand, two hundred and fifty thousand. Earned a beautiful, beautiful uh, speed figure. Ran fifth by four. I mean, the placing is worse than the race she actually ran. Glass ceiling won that race, and Jakarta, as we all know, is very fast. Ran second there. But I'm telling you right now, the number four prodigy doll to me at six to one is surely probably going to be my second pick here. I like this horse a whole bunch in this spot for sure. The number five horse, well, let me take this call. The number five, let me take this call, is an old timer, seven year old mayor with 39 starts, 13 wins. That's a third of her wins. You can't shake a stick at that. Six seconds and five thirds, right? Here is Farrell's second horse in this race. So, um, Jay Farrell, uh, James Farrell has two in here. He has the number five horse, of course, and the number one horse, uh, Easy to Bless. But the number five who we're talking about, let me take this call, speed figures are okay, but two, one or two cuts below here. I don't like the horse, 20 to 1 on the morning line, and it's really, really easy for me to throw the number 5 off the ticket, let me take this call. The number 6 horse, well, here's your other favorite at 9 to 5, of course, we talked about Club Car, who was 6 to 5, well, the number 3 is 6 to 5, and the number 6 horse is 9 to 5, uh, kept waiting. 11 starts, 5 wins. That's almost 50%. This 5-year-old is a very, very nice horse. Falcon Jr. is our trainer, and Kamuch is in the yards. This is going to be my third place uh, horse, uh, third pick for sure. If anybody come and get my number 2 horse from the front end, I think it'll probably be the number 4 or the number 6 in this spot. You know, So don't let Sweet fool you is our top play in here. So there it is in the correction state, very small field, it's New York, so I was compelled to do the race, it's six furlongs, it's four fillies and mares, four year olds and up, there's two favorites in here, the number one club car at six to five, I get it, coming off of a long, long layoff, no thank you, not off the layoff at six to five. Okay, can she win the race? Absolutely. And the second favorite in here is the number six, keep waiting. I'm going to go ahead and take the engine. You don't mind if I take the keys to the engine here, do you? No. I'm going to take the number two horse. Don't let sweet fool ya. Don't let the sweetness fool ya. The number two horse is five to one on the morning line. This horse is going to get a clear lead in this six for long race. And they're going to have to come and get her. And if they do, it will probably be the number six horse or the number four. My second pick in here will be the other horse with value, the number four, Prodigy Doll. I like this horse. I like the race that she came out of over there at Laurel on February 9th um, in the Barbara Finch Stakes. Didn't run a bad race behind Jakarta. So I like the number four, Prodigy Doll, as my second pick. And my third pick, I'm taking the nine to five horse. Keep uh, waiting. This horse is very, very sharp. And this horse is returning off of a 27-day layoff after winning the stake race right here at Aqueduct, which was the Broadway Stakes. And it was 2-1 to one that day with Manny Franco. Manny's not up. You got Kamuch, but that's fine. He's very, very uh, capable, as, as always. So, our top picks in the correction stake. We're going to take the speed. We're going to take the keys to the engine. Once again, a step on the gas pedal. We like the number two. Don't let sweet fool you at five to one. We'll see if they'll come and get her. And then our second pick will be Poly Prodigy Doll at six to one. Uh, the number four horse. So we like two, four, and again, the number six. Keep waiting. Two, four, six for us in the correction. Let me know if you like anything. I think it's supposed to rain on, um, on Saturday, so keep an eye on that. We want to go gate to wire here. Talk to you folks real soon. Thanks.